Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. This is Ishita here and today in this video I am going to review Lotus Herbal Safe Sun Sunblock Cream. So if you are interested then please do keep on watching. So this is how the packaging looks like. It's a regular tube packaging. It's good for traveling. You can easily carry this in your bag. The company claims that this unique cream has been formulated for Indian summers. It contains Persol R1789 and Black Plum Extract for complete protection against the harmful UVA and UVB rays so that it can prevent the skin from aging and tanning. It contains SPF 30, PA++, UVA and UVB protection. It's for all skin type and it's priced at 295 rupees for 100 gram of products. The company claims it's completely sweat and waterproof and hence it's perfect for Indian summer. So now, according to my personal experience, it's completely sweat and waterproof as well and hence it stands by what it claims. You can see when we apply this, it leaves a white cast or a shine on the skin which I personally don't like that much because the white cast or the shine doesn't fade away throughout the whole day. If you have oily skin then it will make your skin appear much much more oily and sticky but I feel this is ideal for dry to normal skin people. If you have combinational skin then still you can try this out. Only one thing you have to keep in your mind that you have to mattify the T-zone area but as a sunscreen it is a really nice product because if you apply this and go out in the hot bright sun then after coming back you will not see any kind of burnt mark or tan on your skin because this product does a really nice job as what it is supposed to do. If you have normal to dry skin then you can even wear this under your makeup as your base because it is going to provide you a very good amount of moisture and shine which will help you throughout the whole day but in the reverse if you have oily skin then it can make your makeup look much more dull and greasy that's why you have to make sure that you are drying this out only if you have normal to dry skin but in case of combinational skin you can even wear this under your makeup but make sure you bake the t-zone area if you have tendency of getting huge amount of pickly hits or rashes in summers then i will suggest you to first try this out in your hand and then only try this out on your face i mean if it suits then only try this out on your face because there are chances that you will end up getting rashes because the formulation of this cream is very thick and other than that one more important point regarding this product is it contains paraben so if you are someone who doesn't uh, want a product which contains paraben then you can skip this one so finally if i conclude all the points then i will give this product four stars out of five because there are two things which is a big no for me first of all if you have oily to sensitive kind of a skin i mean if you are more prone to get pickly hits or rashes then please do avoid this cream that was the first point and the second is that it contains paraben so that's why i'm giving this product only four stars out of five as this is a very good option if you have dry to normal skin other than that also i do have two tips for you the first one is you need to apply your sunscreen at least 10 minutes before you go out so that your sunscreen can penetrate deep into your skin then only it is going to work and other than that the second point is you need to reapply your sunscreen in every four hours because most of the sunscreens in market work only for four hours for watching this video make sure you hit on that like button subscribe if you haven't already once you subscribe make sure you hit on that bell icon next to that subscribe button a very exciting giveaway is running on my channel because my birthday is on 30th and that's why i'm giving away a very nice goodie bag from vlcc and you can win that so what all you have to do to win that all the rules and everything is listed in the description box other than that you can follow me on my social media handles I, that's either on Instagram or else on Facebook. The links for those are also provided in the description box. So that's it for today's video. Make sure you take care of yourself. Bye-bye.